Hello my dear web methods professionals. Today we are focusing on how to use copy condition for mappings. For this, I am going to create a flow service to determine the mode of payment. On the left side of this tab, you define the variables that the service requires as input. On the right side, you define the variables the service returns to the client or calling program. Here I am mapping payment in variable to payment out variable. To apply a condition to the link between variables, click the link that connects the variables. Here I am writing a condition to check if the payment in value is not blank or null. If the payment in value is not blank or null, then only the value will be copied into the payment out. Otherwise it won't be copied. You can also initialize or hard code with a default value. Clear the overwrite pipeline value checkbox if you want to use this value only if the payment in variable does not contain a value at runtime. Let's run the flow service. Here I am providing the input as PayPal. Payment in value has been mapped to payment out as expected. Let's now pass the blank value as input. Default value cash has been mapped to payment out as expected. Thank you.